Yo, what's up you guys? This is your girl Dragon and it's time for another live help session for the creative block. This one's for a pinata. I'm going to be showing you guys how to basically do this really cool thing with your box fight in which players can still build complete box sets. However, they cannot progress further until the timer goes down and the main barrier, you see that black barrier right there drops and then this barrier right here will drop as well. Now I'm gonna just show you how to set up this barrier here um, so that if you have any questions on how that's working and how other creators are doing that, now you will know. So let me go ahead and show you the settings for that. It's really easy and, and it's, it's totally easier than you think. All right, so you're gonna to want to have, of course, two barriers. You see how it's kind of set up here? This is the main barrier that drops. A lot of um, creators would put like brick here. For example, like the Panda Bill Bites, they have brick right there. And then they'll have a very thin barrier that's at a tile length or so, just slightly off. You see how, how that is just slightly off? Um, and that would allow the players to build as well as ramp up. Now, to get this to work, you have to set your barrier um, with a certain type of setting. So let me go ahead and show you guys what's going on. You want to make sure it is enabled always. And it's going to be set to hollow box. And you want to make sure it's the full length or depth of your box. The barrier width is a 0 0.01 or you can do 0 0.05, but you want it to be the thinnest shape as possible, right? And then once you do that, you want to grab the box and go to width and size it down as small as possible so you see this is actually sized down by width to squeeze it so it looks like that so for example this is the way it looks normally we're just going to squeeze that as far as it's going to go just like that All right, once you've done that, you want to go ahead and make sure that it does block the weapon fire, collide what camera could be on, and shrink to allow building is off. And that's it. That's how you set up that type of barrier. The next thing you'll have to do is set it up to be triggered to disable, and that's usually done with a timer when players spawn in. Usually they come in through a teleporter, uh, not a player spawner pad and once that timer goes down both barriers go down and players can fight so that's a simple setup i hope it helps and i'll see you guys in the next one bye